Hey guys, my name is Anup and today we are going to learn how to prepare Excel sheet for bulk upload in WooCommerce. This video is just simply let you know how to make format in Excel for simple products. And if you don't know what are the simple products, you can get one video from the description. I have mentioned the link in the description. So let's get started. So guys, we, I have prepared very basic columns in this Excel sheet and I'll explain you very quickly. So what I have done, I have written a SKU, SKU is your unique product code. So this is the SKU, the name of the product, this is the short description, this is the long description of the product. Then number of stock you have, let's say I have 30 stock of this product. And when you will get notified, let's say uh, you, you are getting continuously orders and you will not get, uh, you will not actually you will not check each time your stock is going to low because you will have at a time you will have thousand of products you can't manually check so if your product stock get low less than two you will get automatically notified from the our system and what is the weight of your product what is the length in centimeter length width in the centimeter and height in the centimeter it's totally optional parameter and these four uh, the totally optional parameter and if you want to automate the shipping part and auto calculation of the shipping through ship rocket or some other platforms then you you it is mandatory to give it is the packing packaging size then this is a sale price this is a regular price you aware about that that then the categories that we have created the categories in the previous video you have to write the same name of the category then tax you can write anything then the images this is the most important part of the images how you have to prepare the images and how you have to link with this Excel sheet so like we have created a folder for the categories we have to create create a folder for products that I have already created and then you have to paste all the images into the same folder so then you have to copy and then you have to paste the images over here by using comma and space then another image of the same product then you have to paste then then you have to paste this particular image also so like this so i have attached three photos so my team will get to, like these three photos are for this particular product and you have to paste all the product images into same folder in it over here like if you're going to add one more product then you have to paste in this and you have to write the name just by separating by comma and how it is repeating so i'm removing this so this is a basic text and then i'm going to show you a quick live example if i upload this particular product how it going to show so this is the this is a dummy website and here are three images one two and three images and this is the name of the product this is the regular price and this is the short description this is the SKU, this is, these are the categories, these are the tags, these are the description and these are the additional information that will come up. So I hope you got a better understanding uh, how you have to prepare your Excel and how you have to save all images into one folder. Then you have to paste the name of the images by separating by comma. Make sure all should be same as the image name because sometimes the image is jpeg and you write jpg so don't write manually just enable the extension from your system and just rename rename and then copy the name of your file and then just paste it will give you like less error because what will happen if you're uploading 100 plus products it will be problematic for you to check manually each and every product individually like where images are coming and images are not coming so i have hope you got better understanding how you have to prepare your excel so you can download the same same particular sheet and then what you have to do once your sheet has been prepared you can download as excel or if you are preparing this particular actual sheet offline then there is no problem and there is no need to download then you have to show in finder then you have to copy and what you have to do you have to do the same process of you have to go in the product and you have to paste your uh, excel sheet into the same folder so you can compress single folder and you have to compress single product folder 
after creating the zip you have to simply transfer all this particular zip file to vtransfer and if you don't know how to use vtransfer you can watch the video i have given in the description and if you find any query you can directly contact to your project coordinator of our team or you can directly comment in this video's description i will share a reply if you are not our customer thank you bye bye see you in the next video